Hello. Please take a seat wherever you think is most comfortable for you. Today we'll be taking very good care of you. Yes. Yes, my name is Natalia and I will be helping you today. Mm -hmm. What is it that you are looking for? Of course, you know that I do makeups for special occasion, but I would like to know what exactly you are looking for today, so I can look for the product that I can do for you, maybe something more smoky or something more like uh, crunchy or very slick, mm, more like wedding, occasion, things more soft, glam, anything that you think maybe. Hmm? Yes? Okay. Oh, that's very good occasion then. Yeah? Oh, that's lovely. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Oh, beautiful. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. So that's like okay, very intimate situation, okay. Do you have like a um, a photo replica or something that you think it will be useful for me to see maybe what sort of a style you're looking for? I see you already have your hair done, so you're just looking for the makeup, yeah? Okay, good. Because I did do also a hair just in case, next time if you want to come back to me, I can do your um, your hair as well. Yeah. Okay, wonderful. So, uh, what sort of look are you looking to do today? Mm. This is not what you're wearing. No. Okay, you're going to go home and then change after. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because I was thinking that you would not wear this to feel it's like formal, yeah. Okay. Do you have a photo? Hmm? Ah, okay, you have a photo of what you would like me to do, yeah. Can I see? Ah, okay. Okay, let me look at you one moment. Yeah, I can't do this. Yes, actually, you know. Pick the most perfect smoky look, I think. I think this will look really good with your features. Mm -hmm. But especially because I really like the way that there is nice, like, um, soft bronziness and a nice glow here, which is like a soft glam look. Yeah, very popular now. Mm -hmm. Okay. And I like this pop of color here, really beautiful. Okay, oh, you must send me this Instagram model page. It's very inspiring. I love to look at Instagram picture for inspiration too. Okay, so I can do this. If I can't give you one suggestion, because your eyes are so beautiful, so big and bright, I would suggest to a little bit darker around here. Just, you see how she has a little idea? Yeah, if we can do like a little bit more smoky and a more like a soul threading, it will look really beautiful. Like right here. Yeah. Especially on the corner of your eye, I think it will look really, really good. What do you think? Oh my god, I love when client give me like creative freedom. It was, it's always a very good moment for me. So, thank you very much for trusting me. <laughs> yes, okay, so take a seat. Do you want any like a refreshment? If you want like a lemonade, water, coffee, tea, something you tell me. Although I would recommend not to drink coffee before formal events, not just because it gives you like a jittery nervous, but also because stain your teeth and it's not a good moment to stain your teeth before formal event. <laughs> yeah. 
Now you're okay? Okay, well, you know you can pause anytime to get refreshment. We have got the refreshment table and we've got snack if you want snack. Anything you need, you tell me. Okay? Alright, are you ready? Mm -hmm. We will start with a nice base for you. I think this one will look really good. Yeah. So we will start with a very nice base. Mm -hmm. This one is from Revolution. But they also have a make. I've got uh, melt makeup. We've got lots of different types. So I think this one will look very I'd say you're a little bit shiny here, but most people are anyway, so I think this will look nice on you. I will use a little on my fingers and rub into your skin. Okay. Of course, my fingers are already nice and sterilized. Okay, so don't worry. <laughs> Softly blending around the face. Nice up here on your forehead. This is a nice mattify primer foundation uh, base. It's not the foundation itself. I will put it on later. So I'll put all over you. I think I will go in with a matte base full coverage pore blurring foundation. I think this will be the perfect color for you because you did send me all of everything that you were looking for today. But I think this is the perfect shade for you. Although you did tell me you were a little bit more tan, so maybe I will have to mix.
just use a little bit of a translucent setting powder so it does not affect the color that I applied on the face the base it will just set it so it becomes less tacky and I can put powder products on top yes because if you put powder product on a wet or tacky or sticky skin it might become patchy even sometimes it will it depends on the, the, the skin type, of course. But just to be sure, I always apply a very light layer of a dust, of, how you say, of translucent powder on the skin. Very lightly. Very lightly. Lightly, lightly. <laughs> Barely anything. So I've got the perfect palette to show you for the look you want. Now, this palette has got a lot of different color, which will complement the look very nicely. As you can see, we have a lot of neutral tones, some nice pops of color, and lots of champagne tones, which are perfect for formal events. Um, suggest mm -hmm. and what you were looking for is like a nice uh, soft glam look mm -hmm. so we can stay towards the cooler browns or the warmer tone browns mm -hmm. depending on the look and also maybe your dress fits a silver dress 
I suggest cooler tones unless you want the pop of color to be the focus so I will do warmer tones if it's what you desire also if you're looking for a different color lip depending on what you're looking for it can change if you want a complete contrast or if you want the focus to be on the eye you can do a soft gloss for example no lip color today okay you have to have lunch okay after lunch you will apply uh, your own lipstick mm -hmm. okay yeah 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 so you already know the color of the lipstick do you know the tonality so I can maybe think about what the color to use nude okay so we can literally do anything that you think you will like but uh, maybe if you show me a picture of the dress I can help you decide have a photo? Okay, let me see it. Let me see. Oh, how beautiful! Oh, this is very classic. Oh, you will look stunning in this. Oh my god, where did you buy this dress? It's beautiful. Okay, it's very formal. Yeah, really long, beautiful. It's like silk. So now I know the color and I think in my suggestion we have to stick to the warm tones here I think a nice uh, taupe color with a little bit of a dark uh, burgundy in the crease just to blend out and smoke out and then in the center I think we can do like a, a champagne color will look stunning yeah and of course I don't want to do anything too harsh because this is a soft glam a soft classic look and with uh, the nude lipstick I think it will look beautiful and also very very classy okay Let's do this then. It will take a mixture of these two taupe colors here. Okay. These two, one and two. And this sort of more uh, deeper, uh, warmer tone taupe. So we'll mix this, this and this to create a good transition shade. Then I will be putting this taupe together with this to create a nice burgundy, matte burgundy along the crease and right in the center I will be putting this champagne color and maybe a little bit of this golden color it will look beautiful very soft, very classic mm -hmm. okay, perfect so I will do this now first I will apply the champagne color with a little bit of that golden shade right along on your eye so just close the eye mm -hmm. oh it is a lovely color and these shades are so pigment it literally glows if I do like this with my finger I will have all the pigments and no fallout whatsoever, which is why I like it. Gorgeous, gorgeous. Okay. And we will do a little bit. I will use my finger to apply uh, the golden shade. Really, really pigment. Usually you use the warmed of your finger to apply the pressed pigment. And it will look even more stunning. So I will do that.
transition shade so let's go into this transition now so to be color
such a 